Well, you know, Saturday came up. You know. <laughs> um, all right. This uh, sometimes you just gotta have fun with words. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so out of that came Mr. E. Expensive ego, eponymous extended play, elegant erotica, early energy, excellence, eloquence, excited evening, eradicating elm tree, electrifying earlobes, egads, election, entertaining ectoplasm, Eastern Einstein, Europe's escargot, empire of enzymes, encircled earth, English eels, Extinguished everyone, engulfed e-reader, entire ether, Easter egg, Esther erased, easy ecstasy, enlarged example, efficient emperor, elite execution, eating Ethiopia, emerging empress, elevated enterprise, England ecstatic, estranged ending, who are you, Mr. E? This one is pretty self-explanatory. The heart is a compass. Rusted needle, find a new destination. Can you visualize it through the ages of dust? We were spinning out of control for some uneven number of... Seems like forever since true love's spell had me head over heels for a significant other who I shall become acquainted and quite fond of. The blizzard prolongs a time of discovery. Force this find, nay, for only a Cretan would be obligated to uncover fool's gold with broken hearts galore. In the darkest caverns, the depths of despair, one pearl rolls politely before my feet. Warm, lonely sigh behind my, behind my ice-cold shoulders. There she stands. Wondrous compass be praised. The needle has led me straight to you. Thank you. And then uh, H two O. Oh. That moistened feeling, that liquid loving feeling, all syllables point to one direction. The fervent masquerade where new couples meet, single and ready to mingle, or afraid and ready to be swayed. Damned if you speak to her, damned if you don't. Want to lose, lose all feeling in the body. Want to lose, lose every capability obtained over the years. Reeling them in like hooked trout of the lake, casting them out, only to grant them freedom that kings will never give. The cellular device does not bring freedom, so it is put on vibrate to avoid the inevitable. Open rectum, insert foot, and alarm clock. Let winter's <laughs> chill arrive swifter than the kick of summer's sun. The thought of viewing love's touch right before my brain-dead autumn leaf eyes chokes my heart and leaves it in a taut knot that only a match could untie. Better an open palm to the face than a closed fist in the heart's core. Is one supposed to enter closed doors with an open mind, or vice versa? The glass that was half full has been consumed down to its last uh, initiative drop. The parched drinker was never an optimist or a pessimist. He was just perplexed in the very idea of life and love intertwining like DNA's double helix form. For, for nearly half a decade, love took the semblance of a malfunctioning roller coaster, heaven and hell on tracked wheels. Fell in love with her before my long lost affair with words and language set me on the right path once again, a block, a nameless block. A shielding force field was placed on the river of creativity. Twas a dam. How could the water, the, the water words be released, freed from their chasm of many leagues, 
by the light of that first dawn, by the kiss of that first pair of baby soft lips, ignite the flames, fornicate desperation, and leave it for dead. The muse, promiscuous as the 21st century population, branches out into numerous categories. Believe, my angel, that all endless wandering ends here tonight. The pen's requiem begins with your smile. Thank you. <laughs>